Hello Facebook! Hi everybody! Happy Wednesday to you. Happy snowy Wednesday. Um, it is Wednesday, uh, March, I think today's the 9th. Um, so happy Wednesday. It is snowy here in New York. I don't know where you're tuning in from, uh, but uh, hopefully you're having nicer weather than we are right now. Um, it is really uh, wet and snowy outside. So I don't know. Let's see if you can see the window there. Probably not. But you can see the snow coming down. We're not getting a lot of snow, but there is snow outside. So um, I, I gotta tell you, I'm ready. I am ready for the winter to be over. I am ready for spring, as most of you probably are as well. Uh, hopefully this is it. Hopefully it is going to start getting warmer because next week in the forecast, I see 50 degrees. So fingers crossed, I can get outside and hike next week. Uh, we'll be traveling uh, with our son watching baseball this weekend. We'll be down in um, we'll be down in Charleston, so super excited about that. Even though the weather's not supposed to be super warm while we're there, we're actually supposed to get rain on Saturday, and uh, he has a double header. And then Sunday um, is in the 50s. So let's see. Hopefully, hopefully we'll uh, get some sun and we'll be outside. So um, and hopefully you'll be able to get outside here in New York. Uh, let's see. So we are closed today. Today's Wednesday. I just thought I'd come on quick and make a quick cocktail, cocktail called Palm Thumb. Um, it uh, has gin, lime juice, pomegranate juice, um, and a little agave. And I'm going to put a sprig of rosemary and um, a uh, dried lime in there. So um, I'll get to that in a minute. We are open Tuesday. We are open on Thursday. Our new special will be coming out. I am not sure uh, what our special will be. We've been throwing around a couple of ideas, so uh, hopefully tomorrow, by the time Marcus goes on in the morning, you'll know what our, um, I think it's gonna be a buy one, get one free. Don't quote me, it's either gonna be the ribeye or the tuna. I'm not 100% sure. The ribeye was so popular last week, we thought we'd run it again. So we, um, that will come out uh, tomorrow. So thank you everybody for watching me. I appreciate it. Hello, Sean. Hello, Michael. Hello, Matthew. Um, hello, Nikki. I appreciate everybody watching me today. Um, let's see. Albie will be here next Friday, next Friday night, the 18th. Albie will be live here at Aroma Time, so that's exciting. We have good friends of ours, Adele and Jeremy, who are going to play here, I believe, the Saturday the 26th, I believe it is. So um, they will be here. It'll be their first time here in Roma Time. They've been guests of, us, of ours for a while. They wanted to uh, come and um, you know play here in Roma Time. So um, let's see. Um, thank you. If you are watching me live, if you can put hashtag live. If you're watching on the replay, if you can put hashtag replay, uh, give me a thumbs up so I know that you're here. I appreciate you watching me. Uh, we've been busy with catering this week. Um, we have so much stuff going on. Our heads are spinning, and uh, we are super excited to bring you all of the awesome, great things here at Aroma Time. Remember, if it is your birthday, you can come in and get a free steak, a new a New York strip steak, on your birthday. If it's not your birthday and you're coming in um, the week before, the week after, or the month of your birthday, um, you'll get 50% off of that steak if you're a vegetarian or vegan. Um, of course, we have options for you as well. So, all right, I am going to make my drink. So, palm of thumb. I'm gonna put some ice in my shaker. I'm gonna actually put some ice in my glass as well. And we are going to start with, um, and look at this, Michael, up by your way, Watkins Glen. I am using Finger Lakes Distilling Seneca Drum Gin today. Um, so that is up on Seneca Lake, on the east side of Seneca Lake. Um, so I'm going to add two ounces of Seneca gin, and I am going to add a little bit of agave. Of course, you don't have to put agave in here um, if you don't like. I find pomegranate juice to be just a little, I don't want to say bitter, but a little dry. So um, I like to uh, add a little bit of agave when I use pomegranate juice. I'm going to add about an ounce of juice. And I'm going to put about five, um, maybe like a half a teaspoon of um, lime juice in my drink. I'm gonna go ahead and shake that on up. So, hello Cheryl, hello Daniel, hello Terry and Christopher. Um, I'm assuming Courtney is with Daniel right now. So, 
Hello, thanks for watching me. We actually have a wine tasting um, here very shortly at Aroma Time. So if anybody is in the area and would like to stop in, we're closed, but if anybody would like to stop in, um, we have a good friend, um, uh, rep, a rep from one of our wine companies coming in to taste us on some wine. So uh, we're excited about that. So uh, Daniel, I'll see you soon. Patrick has already arrived for that. Oh, baby. So, all right. Mm -hmm. I came through your drink, Jamie. <laughs> oh, it smells really good. I am really, I've been drinking a lot of gin lately. Um, I don't know why, gin just, for me, gin has been uh, my go-to lately. So I'm just going to put a sprig of rosemary in there. And I'm going to look at these cute little jars Courtney got this week. So super cute. She dried all of this um, fruit, for, uh, fruit for us. So we have grapefruit and limes. And once it's sitting in the drink for a little while, it kind of, you know, um, seeps out. But look how cute that is. I'm so excited about all of my new cocktails and all of my new um, garnishes because I've been having some fun. So let's give it a taste. Gin, lime juice, agave, and pomegranate juice. Oh yeah. Mm, that is delicious. Oh yeah. I've been drinking a lot of gin and tonics lately, so I've um, been in the mood for gin and tonics and I'm kind of steering away from the wine, um, but I'm excited to have some wine today. And um, that's it for tonight. I hope everybody has an amazingly awesome day. Um, stay safe out there. Please uh, don't go out unless you need to. Our roads are okay, the main roads are okay, but the back roads might not be okay. So please be careful, please be safe. Catch me tomorrow for my Facebook Live. I will be on live tomorrow and um, I will catch everybody soon. Hope everybody has an amazingly awesome day. Thanks again, cheers.